Hello everyone and welcome back to another Doctor Who action figure review. Today I shall be taking a look at the Emperor Dalek from the online animated series Daleks. So this series was part of the Time Lord Victorious range and this action figure was put together by the Fantastic Greens 3D on Instagram and they are available to order right now at the time of recording. But if you are new here, don't forget to click below, subscribe and click the notification bell so you don't miss any of my uploads. This figure doesn't come with any packaging but when it arrives it is well wrapped to make sure that the figure is kept safe and it reduces any potential damages during transit. But taking a closer look at the figure, the overall base is a 3D modelled with no reused parts from the character options line and obviously it is beautifully printed, assembled and painted by Green's 3D themselves. The main figure itself is painted in this lovely bright gold colour scheme which is accurate to how it looked in the series. But looking closely at the finer detailing, the sculpt on the head is obviously the enlarged dome design and it features the four headlights which have some silver paint apps applied to it making it stand out just a tiny little bit and the detailing of the circular pattern on the top of the dome has been detailed with some black paint apps and the eye stalk extends out of the sculpt and has the painted detailing of the silver rod, the white rings and the black eye casing and the actual blue pupil. Obviously this Dalek doesn't have the traditional neck design and on this version of the Emperor it's part of the main spherical dome on the head and just like the rest of the figure the detailing is also part of the sculpt and has been painted in a dark grey as well which I feel really does contrast between the overall bright gold and it looks really beautiful and obviously makes it stand out. There are also a few indentations a part of the sculpt around it as well which look brilliant. Moving to the shoulder section this is similar to most other bronze Daleks from the current series and you can see the detailing of the screws the indents and everything it just looks brilliant and the plunger and the exterminator gun remain to have the same level of detail but the gun is made out of a slightly rubbery plastic which allows the sculpt to have the hollow sections between and it does actually make it more accurate than the character options Dalek. The skirt section it has three hemispheres going down rather than the traditional four and the hemispheres are all separate sculpts to the skirt which means that the paint ups of the dark grey around it don't leak onto the main body of the figure and it does add to the high end quality detailing that this figure does have overall. And the fender is painted in a glossy black and actually looking at the bottom there are three raised sections which when the Dalek is stood up it gives the impression that it is sort of floating like the wheels would do on the actual main Dalek figures. Taking a look at the articulation, yes this figure does have articulation. The head can rotate a full 360 degrees, the eye stalk can move up and down and both the plunger and the exterminator gun can rotate on a ball joint. This gives the figure a fantastic range of movement and it genuinely gives the same feel and enjoyment that the main figures do. And that's all I can say. This figure is absolutely fantastic. Obviously it's available from Green's 3D and the quality is sublime. You can see how much love and how incredible it does look alongside the other bronze Daleks and I'm so so happy to have this in the collection. If you do want to purchase one of these guys I have left Green's 3D Instagram link in the description and I just want to take this moment to say a massive thank you for making this Dalek available because it looks incredible. If you have enjoyed this video feel free to like, comment and subscribe. I am so close to 1100 subscribers so it would mean so much that if you're new here and you haven't subscribed you do. Thank you so much for watching and I shall see you sometime soon for another video. So until then, goodbye for now. Don't forget to click below and subscribe. Well, how could I possibly forget that? For goodness sake. You've got the message, haven't you? Don't forget.